It may not come as a surprise that one of the areas of your home where water use is at its highest is in your kitchen. Your kitchen sink is one spot where water is easily wasted, especially if you are having to wait for water to reach a desired temperature. While insulating your pipes helps getting water up to temperature quickly, one additional way to avoid water waste is to catch the cooler water using a jug while you wait. You can then use the water you caught for something else, like watering your plants, but only do this if you are not using a water softener. Another great tip is to let your pots and pans soak instead of trying to scrape them clean under a running tap. This goes for any dishes that need to be washed by hand. Plug the sink rather than wasting water under a running tap. If you have a dishwasher, make sure it's full before turning it on, as one load can use up to 40 liters of water. In addition, make sure you always choose the shortest cycle to get the same clean dishes. In doing so, you'll use a lot less water. It is also important to ensure that your kitchen faucet is free of leaks. If you notice that your faucet is leaking, the repair may be as simple as replacing your old washer with a new one. Consult your local hardware store on how to repair your leaky faucet or contact a licensed plumber. Ah yes, <laughs> water. In Ontario, we are lucky to have safe, affordable, and accessible drinking water. By simply keeping a container of drinking water in the fridge, you are guaranteed clean, cold water whenever you want. No need to run to the tap to make it cold. Well, let's head over to the laundry room where we find your trusty washing machine. Now, washing machines can use a lot of water, no surprise there. For a large load, a standard washing machine uses 190 liters of water, which works out to be approximately 20% of your daily water use. So, when purchasing a new washing machine, make sure you look for a highly efficient unit that has an Energy Star label. This will ensure maximum savings all around. A front-loading washing machine is your best bet, as your clothes tumble in the water rather than rotate, which means less water is needed to get your clothes clean. In addition, these washing machines remove more water from your clothes during their spin cycles, which means less energy is needed for your clothes drying. Ensure you match your load selection to the size of your load. If you're only washing a couple of things, make sure you have it set to a small load. Or, if selection isn't possible, then make sure you always wash a full load. If possible, avoid running the unnecessary second rinse cycle. This will ultimately save water and expense. Finally, be sure to only wash dirty clothes. An item worn once that has not been soiled can easily be worn again before hitting the hamper. By reducing the amount of water used every day in your kitchen and laundry, you are saving money. Be sure to check our other helpful water conservation videos. Conserving water means saving you money. Use water wisely. Be water smart.